Kundalini Citrine Quartz from the Elwena deposit in the uh, Congo, watering closely on Zambia. Now, first of all, what's interesting about this piece is the lovely uh, white phantom crystal sitting inside this. Coating of uh, hematite going into girthite um, appears like botroids, is actually made up of specularite, little blades of the hematite. Also, very interesting about this piece, there's there must have been, uh, uh, in the formation process, a fracture in the uh, uh, quartz crystal and that got filled with uh, hematite. So the hematite in effect is holding this, this face up. Let's just show you the reflection on the face. It goes right to the top. Quite an interesting specimen. Uh, uh, definitely a sort of a rainbow effect here. It's as if there's, there's life happening inside that crystal. Which of course we give it a good clean, so we're not we're not sending you insects from the Congo. Um, quite quite lovely. So from a display point of view on a turntable, you'd have this effect. This is slightly overexposed. It's going like this. This is a pretty accurate indication of the actual specimen. A very very mild citrine. So I'd I'd actually go with this one on Kundalini uh, Kundalini quartz versus Kundalini citrine quartz. So very very light light citrine but i'd say mainly more clear than than citrine and then of course the white core all the way from the Elwena deposit in the congo